is bringing you guys a quick post fight thoughts video of the Emiliano Vargas, the son of Fernando Vargas versus Julio Martinez fight. They recently fought over in Vegas in the undercard of the uh, Johnny Beck Alim Hanala versus Bentley fight. Events currently going on right now on ESPN Plus. You can go to ESPN Plus and watch the event uh, right now. And um, yeah, the fight lasted with two rounds. The last the fight lasted two rounds with Vargas landing a big left that dropped Martinez. First round. Um, I'm gonna be honest. I missed out in the first round. I'm, <laughs> I'm watching three events right now at the same time. Uh, this event, the the zone event, and the uh, uh, the UFC event. So yeah, a lot of boxing going on, and I'm trying to catch up with the fight. I, I was catching up with the fights. From the UK earlier today, so so yeah, I missed out on the first round, but when I tuned in to ESPN Plus, boom, pretty much that's where it landed. Left hook landed, and uh, I had to replay it because I was like, "What the heck just happened?" Um, but yeah, it's a pretty impressive win debut for uh, Emiliano Vargas with top rank. This is the type of wins. This is the type of fights, uh, and this is a this is how you should look in order to grow a fan base. I mean, he already has a name. He has his dad behind him. Um, if he keeps this up, then he's definitely a future star. Among all the brothers, among the Fernando Vargas sons, Emiliano, in my opinion, is the, the one who has the, the most potential to become uh, a star and a world champion. Um, and with this win, he improves to 2-0. Two wins coming by way of Nakar Tikio at the age of 18 years old. He has a long, long future ahead of him. Um, hopefully, uh, Top Rank will put the right people in front of him and then not rush him. I, I feel like if you go back to Fernando Vargas' uh, career, um, he, he was young when he fought the big names. Um, but Vargas, you know, I think he should take his time and uh, just continue to improve and, and learn and uh, get the experience he needs in order to be one day a, a world champion. As for Martinez, he was one and zero going to this fight. He 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 showed some decent skill. Um, I think you know at his age, I think it's a learning experience. He can lift definitely learn from this and rebound from it and bounce back, and um, you know try to improve. And maybe if he keeps winning fights, maybe in the future, sometime down the line, if he somehow keeps up with Emiliano Emiliano, uh, in moving up in the ranks, maybe they will fight again sometime down the line as an improved fighter um so it's not the end of the world for julio martinez so uh yeah if you saw the fight let me know what did you think about it in the comments thanks for listening thanks for watching and like always have a great day all right thanks